Hi hey everybody, this is Rejected. Uh, it's ironic as well. Do you get the movie reference? Give you a second. That sort of blue, silver, orange bits. It's a reference to Chappie. Whether you like the film or not, I like it. And quite like Chappie, this has been rejected a couple of times. They painted it the first time, didn't go well because of the temperatures. Second time, painted it, was good. As you can see, it's good, nice, tough finish. And then I found this small, well, it wasn't this mark actually, it was just a slight mark in the paint. And if I see something like that, I'm going to rub my nail on it, I'm going to give it some grief because if it chips like this has, it's not up to my standards. So it means I've got to strip it and repaint it. And because I'm so frustrated with this thing, I'm thinking about being a bit crazy and just attacking it. Because Chappie was not clean. Ch Chappie was defective and was damaged. And I'm thinking about basically taking out my frustrations on this, smoothing it out and re-clear coating it. I don't know if it's going to work or not, we're going to find out. These hands are painted by me too. <sighs> God, they come off easy enough. I haven't put the second hand on because I was literally that. That's how close I was to finishing this. I thought it was done days ago, and then I'm like, oh man, <clears throat> it's completely thrown my day out. The way I was going to do things today, but whatever. I'm angry now. Careful. To give you an example of one of the things I do, I polish or I sand the head so they're slightly brushed, they just look nice. So all these belong to this and this must be safe because I don't want it getting damaged. These can't be lost, I can't be asked to put them together. There's a bag, there's a baggie. It begins. Have I lost my mind? Quite possibly. I've lightly corrected the number to 22. I've added police, which I'm going to clean up a little bit. And I've also added reject, because I hate this thing now. <laughs> this might turn out quite good. It might not, I don't know. Honestly, this is pure annoyance and frustration at this thing. So let's just use that to my advantage and try something stupid, you know? And the reason I'm using the thinners is to clean up the thinnest bits of the paint. It will dry, and once it's dried and the uh, solvents are gone, it will be okay to paint on again. Right, 
Right, so I've warmed this up, and now I'm gonna give it several coats of clear coat. And I'm, one of the good things about clear coat is it will actually slightly melt the paint that's there, so it'll smooth it out, and then the added layers should hopefully build up protection over it, and it'll make it look cool, and it should bring it all together a bit more, make it pop, I hope. This might be a really dumb idea. <laughs> Okay, the first layer is a thick layer. You might be surprised by that. I've done quite a lot of work with these paints and that lacquer and experimented with stuff and tested its resistance and made cool pattern stuff. Um, and I'm pretty happy that that will set fine. I want to use a lot because I want it to melt the surface down and then all reform and then it'll get another couple of thin coats just to really thicken it up. I've lost my mind. I've definitely lost my mind. Okay, well that clear coat is all set, as you can see, the, like the police marking and the reject, <laughs> reject marking are uh, visible. It's nice and shiny all over, and there is a good, good thick layer of clear coat on that. It makes it look so much better. Now I've just got to pop the thing back together. And it is done. I actually quite like it. It's beaten. It doesn't. It it looks aged. Signed on the back. That actually looks pretty cool. I'm pretty happy with that. If no one else wants it, well, whatever. I might keep it myself. But I think if you're a fan of Chappie, you will get that reference. It's a nice subtle hint. Maybe people are like, why the hell is that so smashed up? And then if they get the film, they'll get it. Maybe I don't know. Anyway, thanks for watching this bizarre little video. Um, Maybe that's a true artistic expression. Anger, rejection, <laughs> everything goes in so perfectly. Uh, the hands are clean because they're replacement parts, like in the film. Um, yeah. I'm probably nuts. But if you liked it, give us a like. Catch you next time. If you enjoyed this video and the other content on the channel, please consider following the links in the description to show your support.